From the early days after his impeachment acquittal, Attorney General Ken Paxton has promised retribution against the lawmakers who worked to impeach him. But he's not stopped at the legislature. He's also working to unseat the three Republicans on the Court of Criminal Appeals up for re-election this year. The Court of Criminal Appeals, which is entirely Republican, is the highest court in Texas for criminal cases. One of their most high-profile cases recently is 2021's State of Texas versus Stevens, in which the court ruled 8-1 to one that the Attorney General's office did not have the authority to unilaterally prosecute election fraud crimes. That's up to district attorneys and local prosecutors. That ruling was more than two years ago, and it was reaffirmed in 2022, but Paxton has made clear he disagrees with it. Flash forward to 2024, and Paxton is endorsing primary opponents to three of those judges up for re-election this year. Paxton has endorsed Gina Parker, David Schenck, and Lee Finley, Republican challengers to Barbara Hervey, Sharon Keller, and Michelle Slaughter, respectively. Now, much of this race is playing out on social media, but run-of-the-mill mudslinging can walk the line of undermining the state of the judiciary.